we're talking about this tropical storm coming in. Now, we knew about this storm coming in last week sometime, right? So, in order to prepare for that, most of us down here um, don't get too concerned a lot of times depending on the how bad the rain and wind is, right? Because we know that at some point in time, we're going to experience a tropical storm or a hurricane at some point in time down here. But my point with this is, is no matter where you're at in the country, you, you can't control nature, okay? There's only one that controls nature, and he's over everything, right? So, at the end of the day, everybody across the country, appreciate that, Scott, y'all too, everybody across the country experiences some type of storm in their area, okay? Hurricanes, tornadoes, snowstorms, blizzards, freezing temperature, extreme heat, uh, sandstorms, uh, typhoons, whatever you want to talk about you could go anywhere around the country and there'll be some type of storm all right well the people that live there know that they know that at some point in time because of where they live they may experience some of that now not everybody's going to experience the same level of storms as others uh, some storms may be worse than others some, some may last longer some may have a greater effect on them but my point with this is what's up aj my point with this is you know i'm going somewhere with it everybody at some point in time is going to go through a storm there, there there's going to be something what's up chris kilpatrick there's going to be something that happens in your life you know i mean if you're a human being there's going to be something that happens in your life you may not always know what it is or what's going to happen it could be a death it could be a sickness it could be all that and a lot of times you can't really prepare for that fully like you can like uh, uh you may know a tornado is coming you may know there's a hailstorm coming. You may know there's a hurricane or a tropical storm coming. And you have time sometimes to prepare for those. Not always, but sometimes. But in life, a lot of times things hit you just like that and you really don't have time to prepare. It hits you and you got to adapt after the situation hits you. Okay? You got to figure out how you're going to overcome that now. Okay? Though you may not be able to prepare for it fully. Yeah, you can surround yourself with people you love and stuff like that. What's up, Don Box? And have people that you can confide in. But my point is, when that storm hits you in the life, which we're all going to have, but you may not always know what that storm is, okay? Much like this tropical storm coming in, we knew this thing was coming a few days ago. Exactly, Brian. We knew this thing was coming in, right? And it wasn't going to be that bad, so we didn't go out and buy a bunch of water, stuff like that. Some people may have along the coast. But in life, a lot of times, these storms hit you, and it's not how you prepare for them because a lot of times, exactly, exactly, Scott, you may not, un, you may not know what the storm's going to be, so you really can't prepare fully for it, okay? But when it hits, how do you adjust? How do you adapt? How do you move on from that storm? How do you work through it? What's the steps you take, right? Do you let that storm keep you down and you never come out of it, right? Because I'll tell you, sometimes in life, we'll take something and we'll get it on us, and a lot of times it's hard for us to overcome it. But a lot of times, if you can overcome that storm in your life, you can get stronger, you can get better, right? But keep in mind that, keep that in mind today, is that everybody is gonna go through a storm. You may not always be able to prepare for it, but how you get out of it is what's gonna make you a better person and make you stronger. Hope this helps somebody today. I didn't wanna talk for a long time today, but with these storms coming in, made me think about that today. That though we know that this storm was coming, and you can try to prepare for it, you don't always know the extent of the storm. Even if you know the storm's coming, you don't even know the extent of the storm, right? Until it hits. And then after it hits, then you've got to go from there and figure out how you're going to put everything back together. So y'all go out today. Everybody be safe that's in this area. Um, I, hope that, uh, I hope that everybody's safe. I hope that everybody gets through this pretty, pretty good. Um, I know this is just the beginning of hurricane season for us. And uh, when the first one's a tropical storm and it hits you, you really don't know what to expect the rest of the year. But you do know this. You do, do know there's going to be more. We don't know how many, but we know there's going to be more. Okay? So y'all go out there today. Y'all be safe. Take care of your family. Love each other. And if you're in the car business, I hope y'all have a great last Memorial Day, holiday day. And y'all sell some cars. The fist pump guy selling cars the right way because it's the only way I know. Follow the fist pumped enterprise.